match day is, is a tough day. You know, yeah. even you know, you wake up, you have a bit of breakfast. You know, you might get to lie down for a half an hour, hour with an early kick off at you know two two forty five, mm. and um, you know you get up and you eat your pre match meal. It's disgusting. It's hard to keep food down. You're just that nervous, pent up nervous energy that you know the match is so close yet so far away, and you know your mind is playing, trying to play tricks on you. And um, you know, it's it all sort of magically evaporates once you you get on the field and kick off. But you know, the day of the game, it's you know particularly hard. The build up, um, the idea of the I've, I've I've said it a few times, but I'll just say one more time: the idea of, that it fell on St Patrick's Day, as I say, in Twickenham, uh, was was that did that add to the enormity of the of the event, or was that just a, a calendar coincidence for you guys? I think it adds massively. Does it to the outside atmosphere created yeah. and you know the buzz around the public who you know have been incredible for us through the through the tournament but you know as a player group I suppose in some ways you can't really let that affect you you know you have to keep a cool head you have to make the correct decisions at the correct times and and uh, you know it's in a certain way you have to try to block it out to just focus on how you perform and just keep the, kind of keep the head. Yeah, keep the blinkers on and, you know, keep working hard and, and keep doing what you're, you're supposed to do.